Hello, hello, beautiful souls. I'm Esther, also known as Schmexy Pants. Welcome to my channel. Today, I wanted to talk about where I've been and the idea of practicing what I preach and what happens when I don't. You know, we're all human. We all know that it's important to have balance in our lives, you know, to balance action with resting, to you know, work on the things that we're passionate, and then also to be there for other people. Um, and then December, which um, at the time of this recording, it's January 4th. December for a lot of people is a really kind of like go, go, go month. You know, in the Northern Hemisphere, it's winter, a lot of people celebrating various holidays, um, gatherings, really great things that can also be very taxing and exhausting. So for me, things have been kind of go, go, go since I want to say like mid-November-ish. Um, family visiting, myself kind of being out of town, dealing with some health things, which I'll get to in a minute. And then, you know, a lot of positive things again like um again I'll get to in a minute but starting another YouTube channel um but I really didn't let myself rest so how did this manifest for me well if you can see my skin see there's like dryness around my eyes a scratch here lips are dry this is actually so much better than it's been in months um my skin reacted and I mean some of this is definitely environmental like we haven't had a real winter where I am in Ontario it's been more like October outside so the grass is still actually growing and there's a lot of mold in the air stuff that usually the snow would cover so it's affected on my skin but not taking the time to rest putting others before myself um, in terms of like family obligations um, or just you know not letting myself just stop and telling myself I'm lazy if I want a nap um, just made everything worse. I still had a beautiful holiday for the most part. Um, but, you know, on this channel, I always talk about finding that balance and allowing yourself to rest. So I want to call myself out for not practicing what I was preaching in that regard. And so it made a lot of other things harder than they had to be. Um, you know, my not resting, it made my skin flare worse. It made my temper much shorter. It made my ability to discern which kind of energies as an empath were my own and what was others. It made it kind of blur those lines. And it made me feel a lot less inspired than I normally would to post videos because, you know, you can't pour from an empty cup. Um, so it was really hard also to come to terms with, you know, the fact that I know I'm beautiful. Um, so that's something that like body image and body dysmorphia is something that I've dealt with in the past, but I've worked really hard to overcome it. But with my face kind of being at the centerpiece and being on video, I haven't felt like being on video. So let's move into the next piece of this, which is self-compassion and forgiveness of self. So yesterday it kind of hit a breaking point where I got home from an appointment where I got an allergy shot um, which, which is regular for me. I mean, I'm, I'm allergic to cats and my boyfriend has three cats. So, you know, it's, it's totally one of those things that it's like, it's a good thing. But my body just said no afterward. And for the first time in a long time, I just listened. And literally I went and ran one errand that I had to do, um, right after my shot. And then I got home, got back in my Mickey Mouse pajamas and then slept for pretty much the entire afternoon and then did a whole lot of nothing in the evening, to be honest. Um, caught up on some TV, which I haven't done in a while, and just let myself rest. And then this morning, too, I was supposed to get up for another, you know, um, obligation. And I had to just cancel. And it was something that I kind of didn't want to cancel, but I just needed to sleep. And so now it's like probably, I don't know if it's like 1 or 2 p.m. where I am. And I'm just finishing off my coffee. I just had my breakfast. And I don't feel guilty because it has allowed me to be on this platform and be honest and say that, you know, first of all, 
if you don't build rest into your schedule, into your day, even if you're not somebody who is dealing with burnout or who is dealing with physical challenges the way I have, your body, like there's that cliche saying that if you don't make a day for rest, your body will choose. It will. It will every time. So kind of giving yourself that permission to take that rest, knowing that in the long term, you'll get where you want to be faster because you're, you'll be less likely to have a whole system flare or shut down. And then the second piece of it, again, is that compassion and forgiveness for self for when you haven't taken that time. You know, it's one thing to be in a state of burnout or pain or whatever. It's another to be hating on yourself while you're already in that state. So really kind of hugging that inner child and, you know, affirming to yourself that it's okay to make mistakes. It's okay to mess up. Um, you know, it's it's okay. Like you're human. That's part of your learning curve. Even if you're like me, you have to learn some of the lessons over and over. It's okay. So I just wanted to give you that news and let you know that that's kind of why I've been off of here for the last month or so and then also something new and exciting which you know is in some ways contributing to the the tiredness but not really it's more of a fun passion project um i have a new channel that i'm a co-creator on it's called workshop at a church i'll link it below um yeah it's it's my partner and i we are you know creating art and um building things and carpentry and all of that good stuff so if you want to see that and some really really cute cats um head over to workshop in the church i will still be posting here on schmexy pants i do love supporting everybody here who you know watches and i want to thank you uh for your continued support in 2024 and i'm just sending you big love and wishing you as always a beautiful day